Happy New Year! We want to wish you guys a Happy New Year. It's 2018. We are so excited for what this year is going to bring for us and we hope you guys have the best year of your lives. We wanted to take the opportunity to relive 2017. It was an amazing year for us and we want to share with you all the really exciting and fun things that happened to us. And for a lot of the things, you guys were along for the ride. The new horse at the horse barn? Yeah, Levi. Levi? Yep. He's showing you his butt. And you like, get too. Away. He's like, get away. Oh, here he comes. Last year at this time, you guys became star riders for the very first time. Not only did you guys become star riders, but you started to hook up with subscribers for the very first time and meeting them in Star, in star Stables. What happened? Uh, unread mail. Unread mail. Let's see who it's from. She's so excited, you guys. You guys missed it in yesterday's vlog. One of our subscribers found Gabby on Star Stables and sent her mail. Are you guys friends now? What? Are no, you... we have to meet up. Last year, do you guys remember what you guys got at Christmas time? That ended up becoming the focus of this whole entire year. Some toy that you guys play with obsessively. Computer? No. Schleich, you guessed it, Sophie. Last year at this time, the girls had just opened their very first Schleich and were hooked. In February, you guys probably forget, um, but Sam and I celebrated. What did we celebrate, Sam, last February? Oh, I know, I know. Christmas. No. Your anniversary. Right, you guys probably don't know, but Sam and I are married on Valentine's Day. We always have a special date night on Valentine's Day. It's the one day every single year Sam and I get together and just do our own thing, leave the girls home. You guys like that though, right? Yes, and I remember uh, we kept tuning on the bed while watching a movie. <laughs> okay. And the best thing is, I don't have to remember another date. Yeah, because Valentine's Day is our anniversary. The other really big highlight in February for me last year was when we rescued three animals. Three things, oh, remember? I know, I know, I know. What? Raccoons. No. Do you remember when we rescued them? Squirrels. No. Three little things that we Kings. fell in love with and we wanted to keep them all. They're a big, huge passion for us. Kittens. We no. have puppies. Yes, we rescued three chihuahuas last February. You guys remember? <coughs> Leo. Oh! So many chihuahuas. Six. This is Milo, and he is really little too. He is bigger than the other ones, but he's still super tiny. Like honestly, when can you ever find little dogs as little as this? This is Luna. This is Leo. He's my favorite, and isn't he just the cutest? March 2016 changed our life. It is the single most important month that changed our life. Do you know what happened? Oh, is it when we changed? With horse camp? We went to horse camp, that's right. The girls were happy at their barn, loved the horses where we used to ride for years, and decided to go to horse camp. But the only place that offered a horse camp for spring break was the one that the barn that we go to now. It changed our life. I can hoof pick. I know, that's amazing. You can, and I can lift the hoof all by myself. So Sophie can finally hoof pick and she can lift the hoof all by herself. So after the girls went to um, March break camp at our new barn, we talked really hard with you guys and together about deciding to change barns. It was something that we struggled with and we kept going back and forth with, but in the end, we made the best decision ever. Do you guys, are, are you guys happy we changed barns? Yeah. How old did you turn? 10. Go 
Debbie had her 10th birthday and um, another really exciting thing that happened in April last year was that we rescued another baby animal. Do you guys remember what it was? It was one single animal. It was Crow white. Bailey. No, it was white and we loved him but he was super annoying you guys. We rescued a baby goat. It's not the first baby goat oh! that we ever rescued. But we rescued a baby goat and he was both amazing and incredible and annoying like baby goats can be. He's super cute and neat. Unfortunately, we had to find him a new home. We were just a, a stopping ground for him to find him someplace better, and we had to say goodbye. And that was really hard. Do you guys remember? I almost cried my head off saying goodbye. Oh, to yeah. Him. You. Come here. Say bye bye. You want to pick him up? That's it you guys, he's gone. And I miss him, I felt so sad when we said goodbye because he's just in a big pen and even though there are other animals there and the little cow gave him a big kiss, did you guys see that? Yeah. I just feel sad like, like what? there's nobody to love him. There's nobody to love him. In April, Gabby made her very first Star Stable Online video on her channel and now she's obsessed. She's another one I have to edit and she's another one planned. She's really excited about making more Star Stable videos, huh? Yeah, and now I'm gonna do a Minecraft stable tour. Eventually. Probably in 2018. We started looking for our very first farm in May. We went to lots of houses. We shared them all with you guys. You guys all voted and told us what you thought. Unfortunately, we didn't find one yet, but we're hoping that this new year is going to bring us into buying our new farm. Also in May, Gabby finally was allowed to jump at the new barn. Yay. Gabby also had her very first fall at the new barn and developed a fear of jumping. No! You can do it. Come on, you can do it. Try it. At the very end of June, we hit 3,000 subscribers. Do you guys remember that day? Yeah, we were yard sailing. We had a yard sale and we hit 3,000 subscribers and that's when our channel took off. We had been vlogging for two and a half years. We finally hit 3,000 subscribers last June. For whatever reason, it started the ball rolling and our channel really started to grow. Also in June, I fell in love with Ziggy for the very first time. Do you guys remember that? Yeah. Before that, I was not even interested in horses and all of a sudden, Falling in love with Ziggy changed everything for me. And me. Not me. <coughs> she never loved Ziggy. Yeah. No, I did. She did what? Hello, Ziggy. Come on, come on this way. Come and say hi. Come here, boy. Yeah. Daddy, I want to pet I love, love this horse. Oh, my Oh look, he loves me. He's like, oh, you guys are so nice. You want, you know how you want us to get the flies off you. Look at him, how he stares straight in your eye. I swear you could hug him and kiss him and he'd be happy. It's a fly sheet. Yeah. In July, Gabby really started to struggle with her jumping because of her fall and she was super scared, super nervous, right Gabby? Yeah, and it's something you guys know, it's something that happens when you have a fall like that. You just get scared and it takes a while to build back your confidence. We also decide to start looking for our very first horse. July is the month when I started to casually look and see what kind of horses were out there and I started showing you guys horses that we were interested in and that's when it all started. In August, Sophie rode Ziggy. He was brand new to the lesson program. He is a, a green-ish horse. He doesn't, he, there's a lot of controversy over the fact that I call him a green horse. 
But Sophie wrote them at seven years old and we got a lot of flack for that video. Do you remember? We made a video called Green Horse Green Horse. Green Horse. Seven year old rides a green horse. And we got a lot of flack for that video. The very worst thing that happened to us last August was that we need, ended up saying goodbye to one of our dogs and it was a horrible time in our family. All right, guys, we are here at the vet and we are just getting ready to say goodbye and it is super sad. We went on a family trail ride and it inspired me so much. I enjoyed myself so much and the relationship I enjoyed with the girls on that ride that um, I decided to take lessons. <laughs> In September, we hit 10,000 subscribers. Do you remember that? Brooklyn and Jacob. Brooklyn and Jacob were here, and we hit 10,000 subscribers. It was amazing. We also had to say goodbye to our rescue bird. If you guys don't remember, we rescued a baby crow, and it was, I was so attached to that bird. Saying goodbye to him was one of the hardest things I've ever done. Do you guys remember when we said goodbye to him? Yeah. yeah. A lot of you guys still remember that. I don't know what it means, but there's a smile upon your face. In October, our barn closed because our instructor got married and we were able to lease for the very first time two horses. It was the first time we ever were in charge of horses, went to the barn on our own and rode by ourselves. We had so much fun in the month, um, that month spending time with our friends, riding horses. Do you guys remember all the videos we made hanging out at the barn? They were, it was a, a, such a good month for us. Canter bareback. Oh, okay. Hey, I'm gonna slide off his butt. Oh, yeah, just keep going. You're good. <laughs> yeah, You're almost there. <laughs> oh! That experience was so amazing for us that we continued to search for our own horse and we ended up going and trying out a few horses to see if they'd be a good fit. Do you guys remember when we rode those horses that you could hardly even stay on? Oh, the crow hopping one? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. that wasn't a good fit for me. That was not a good fit. <laughs> All right. You're okay, you got it, Gabby. So in November, November 2016 was the most momentous month for us ever in the history of the world because we got a horse. We got a horse in November. November the 2nd, we got Sabrina. She came to our farm. I have so many amazing memories of when we first got her. So which horse did we choose? at our barn and we are just so happy there now huh also in November we got to share our horse with some family and we had a video entitled my dad rides my horse and my, and my brother, brother rides, rides my, my horse. horse and they are two of my favorite videos of all time <laughs> she spooks yeah. on them both yeah I was a yeah no <laughs> he's an expert except for you're still not going fast <laughs> the arrival of Sabrina, we also got a crash course on what having a mare was really like, our stubborn mare. Do you remember the time we went down to the barn and we had a lesson and we couldn't get our horse to go up to the barn? Do you remember that? We learned so quickly how to deal with a moody mare. Oh my God, she's listening. She's like, look at her ears. She's she's tried to kick twice. See, again, she just put her foot up. And walk her forward, forward. Like, that's what I do. Yeah, faster, a little faster though. 
come. Look at her. She's stretching out her neck really far, but she's not coming. And here we are, a year in total. We are back to December and and finally, after six months and a big fall, Gabby is starting to become super confident about jumping again. It is a huge process, huh, Gabby? Yeah. But and she I jumped two feet. We do our very first Christmas at the Barn special where we sing. And if any of you guys saw that video, you know that none of us can sing. But we did it anyway. We had so much fun. And it was beyond our editing capabilities, but we had a lot of fun doing it. Did you guys, did you guys have fun doing that? Yeah. weather this year. Yeah. We have hit record lows and it's just been crazy for the horses and for us and for riding. And the last really important thing that happened this year in December was that the girls got brand new, brand new, what did you give her? Tack! Brand new tack. They got a brand new bunny. Oh yeah, bunny. <laughs> they got brand new bunnies for Christmas. They love them. And having now. I want a buddy for myself now. This is my buddy, you guys. Meet Taylor. And do a bit of um, a year in review. We are so excited to see what's going to happen this next year. What do you think is going to happen this next year? We're going to get Schleich I'm going to get a horse for myself. Yeah. I'll be riding it. I'll be training it. And I'd we're going to get a farm for sure, 100%. As soon as the weather clears, we're going to reserve Zoom our search and what else do you guys think we're gonna get for sure this year? More Schleich. Is there nothing that you want more than Schleich? A, a horse. A horse. A horse. Baby bunny. Baby bunnies. A horse, you guys. We are gonna get our very own forever, for real horse. We're gonna start looking soon. Again, as soon as the weather clears, we'll start that search and we are so excited and happy to share all of our new adventures with you guys. In 2018, I'm going to be filming a Minecraft barn tour. Gabby just got Minecraft yesterday and she has been so excited about it. What are you going to do for 2018? What are your plans for your channel? I'm um, making a um, Star Stable video. So who wants to do her very own Star Stable video? That is super exciting. We all have super exciting fun plans for this year. We'll see you guys later in our next video. Bye! Bye. <laughs> Don't go over how did you get out of here? <laughs> <No>, what's happening? <laughs> Clover! Should old acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should old acquaintance be forgot and all, all anxiety?